So NC, we work with the uh, KMUD, S-O-A-D, work with the uh, Chiang Mai student. The goal is to uh, bring people out of their um, familiar place. The subject is uh, distance of Mejam, this, this town, what, what happened inside, how people live, and what is the real uh, life, not just only beautiful side of the place but also the, the problem that people have in living here. We would love uh, that uh, the, the project could be part of improving the, the daily life of, of the people in, in the village. Uh, I, I don't just solely uh, waiting for just the end project. The, the way to the end is also, also for me uh, uh, the objective of, of the pro of the workshop. So it's really important to uh, to uh, have different material, uh, different uh, input into yourself and and see the world bigger than than where you are. So exchange information. Uh, after that, we will then we will walk to the school. It's about mm -hmm. two hundred meters. Actually, the uh, the town is really uh, known for the um, the weaving. Because normally you, you just uh, run the thread through. Uh, 
and uh, it's a technique here that when they weave, uh, they have a small tool like needle to pick up the thread uh, that let them make the very complex uh, um, graphic and textile pattern. So young people, they, they wouldn't like uh, put their energy, their time for, for this thing because they can earn more money and be more comfortable with something else. So uh, this knowledge will disappear or die with the old generation. I think the knowledge itself is rather yeah, quite important uh, to, to preserve. And, yeah. ความเจริญน่ะมันก็ดีดีอย่างหนึ่งมันโลดแค่ใช้จ่ายเนาะมันหน่อไม่รวยอ่ะอืมไม่ใช่ไม่ได้ใช้เงินฟุ่มเฟ
<laughs> what happened when they were already yeah. gone? <laughs> Actually, in the school, like the traditional um, skirt thing. The parent actually have to wait for the for child, the and then the child will like actually appreciate it because she that child has to wear it every Friday, uh-huh. and like only parents wait for them, and then like when this child grow up, they have to wait for their children and keep on going. It's yeah, like yeah, a school yeah. tradition. Okay. okay, and like is it like just here or like around Thailand? No, just here. Okay. Oh, nice. But I don't know if that work, system work. actually like, works. Like, is it? Is it? Yeah. yeah. Is it like you really working? It's just like question to ask like yeah. to kids. <laughs> maybe they can maybe want to maybe they have another dream not just in the village to do some craft and maybe they will they they will want to earn more money. Maybe we can uh, find a method how can we add more that uh, value of the trash. Do you know what what kind of trash you can we find? Like uh, we can see today the building that they keep the trash. Mm. Oh yeah. I was really curious to work with uh, the Thai students uh, and to discover new craftsmanship. The village did impact me a lot. Um, I think the thing that I've noticed the most is I really thought that we were going to go in a place where there would be more needs that we could actually identify problems. But the truth is that they're completely self-sufficient. What it's like to live on your resources. Uh, to you know have a small community where that's very like close maybe the only way that i think that we can help them is to communicate in a good way what they're doing so that it's not destroyed in the future Uh, in our university in Taiwan, we seldom do a lot of research about the product. Also, do modern uh, product. Uh, I just use my university time to experience Thai culture or some traditional craft in there. Uh, the most interesting is we can just talk to the elder villagers, and I think, wow, it's so cool because. Uh, they will friend. Uh, they, are, they are friendly, and they will happy to share some things to to us. Then we can do some interesting design. It's like they do. Oh, my If you actually like live there, and then you like a kind of experience like what they experience in their life some of the beliefs are like spirits and like traditional and like sometimes new generation kind of like not care and like they didn't know like how it impact their life since we like designed for them as a case study their their like aspect and stories is important to like kind of have it in our design in like understanding way
center here in Chiang Mai or in Paris, you have a lot of things come to you in the same time. So this then is an, an a chance and an occasion to to find the balance for myself. It would help me to like uh, filter some something being at distance. I don't see it as like straightforward distance, like how far or like the size. I see it as like the deep meaning of something like time or age or generation gap or something like that. Distant Taiwan and Thailand, everything is, is fresh. I can experience the new things and share uh, more experience to my friend, my family or, or learn more things I can use in my job future. So I think, yeah, it's interesting about the distance.